hi guys today's video i'm going to show you how to laravel code with ai and today's days you can see that ai is going more powerful and you can see that how release the chat gpt gemini ai grok and that's going to help you with the code so you must have to be advanced with ai and as a laravel developer so in this video i'm going to cover and i will i want to introduce there is a new tool that will be awesome with development so that is the cloudy ai and cloudy ai will help you to code you don't have to write anything just you need to give the prompt and that will help you to create the pages create the cloud application and so more things so let me go to that cloud website so you can see on my screen there is an official website is cloud.ai so cloudy.ai and you can see that first let's review the pricing and you can see that you can easily use as a free but that should be a some limitation token okay but you can see that they have a just pro plan and max plan as well so you can see that right now i just buy the pro plan with 17 dollar a month and that's really awesome i have just checked with that so it's just worth it with as a developer so this was just pricing and how can we use that that's let's get started so before start i want to show you that you need to install the cloudy ai in your desktop like if you are using the macbook linux or windows let me go to the download page and you can see that they have already given the options how to download you can see that for mac for windows you can see over here and that's you just need to scan the qr and all you can install it okay so make sure cloud should be cloudy should be installed in your system so i'm using my macbook and let me go to my terminal and how it looks you can see that and just i'm going to use cloudy and you can see that this command is enabled because i already have installed the cloudy in my macbook so just hit enter and let's wait you can see that directly it is asking for the prompt so you can see that run a terminal and you can ask anything like hey create a laravel project or whatever you can ask them so let's get started the proper way how to down like how to create the pages and how you can do with laravel code so let me just cancel for now okay and let me clear this my terminal and first of all i'm going to create a new fresh laravel application so let's go step by step so just i will call laravel new and you can see that it is asking for project name so i will say laravel ai app okay and hit enter it is asking for which target kit you want to install so i will say live wire and i will keep authentication and i will like to use the vault and keep the default testing framework and just wait to install next you can see that it is asking for npm install and npm run build i will say yes because we have used the default uh, authentication system so that's why just wait and you can see that our laravel application is downloaded properly so let me go to the laravel ei app and you can see that composer run dev so i'm going to just run that command okay and you can see that it will be run my laravel application on 8000 port and as well as npm run dev as well so let me go to my browser and just go here and let's double check if i go 80000 and you can see that if i click on register you can see that there is a registration form if i go and use the fact filler and click on create account you can see that there is a fresh up and running laravel application is installed successfully now let me go and this open this project to vs code editor okay so first of all let me go to my terminal go to the new tab and just i will use code dot and hit enter and you can see that our laravel application is open on vs code editor okay so first first the step you need to download the cloudy ai extension so go to the extension and just type cloudy okay and you can see that there is a first you can see this is the icon of cloud ai and click on that cloud code and i already have installed so that's why i don't have to install you can see that uninstall and i can install it as well so you can see that this is the extension you just have to install it so after install if i go here and you can see over here there is a small icon that you will be found in your vs code editor so just let me close this and just open any file over here and you can see that there is a cloudy icon icon and if i click on it you can see that it's automatically launching the cloudy ai 
if you already running then it will be automatically come this command prompt but first time when you are doing it will ask for the authorization on uh, live website so you don't have to worry but i already have installed in my uh, system so that's the reason and i already have logged in so that's why it is not going to asking me again so this is the laravel 12 the fresh project and what i'm going to do so let me go back to chrome and you can see that here is the dashboard i want to create a simple and demos so i can show you how to code with cloud ai so here i'm going to create a new user space and list of all the users i will display there okay just let me go and what i'm going to do just i need to write the one prompt say like create user space and display all the list of users in laravel live wire okay and then i will say add link to site bar okay just simple the prompt i'm going to use and just hit enter it is going to scan our laravel application entirely and just wait a moment you can see that they have automatically scanned our laravel application and they have created they know about that we are using livewire vault and they have done that and just say like do you want to add it i will say no and you can keep yes so i will just say yes over here and you can see that it is going to create a new page for the component just wait and you can see that they have automatically add the routes as well so i will just make it yes because that was the correct You can see that they have automatically find the sidebar and add the link so i will just make it say yes you are right and just making done that things and you can see that our project is up and running so now let me go back to the browser and you can see that on go to the users and you can see that there is a list of users you can see over here display and they have created a proper page over there because they understand what we use like flux we use tailwind css we use and they have created let me just log out this user and let me register a new user and just click on create and go to the users you can see that that all these two users have displays over here so this was very basic and simple example how to do with cloud ai and for the starting getting started so that way you can be a more advanced developer with ai so if you like this video then share with your friends and don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel for more videos about laravel ai